Okay, hello, welcome back to more Abadox Blind. In the last one, we beat the first couple levels relatively easily, and then we hit this big old roadblock here. Okay, so the bullets that come out of those come out in like a predictable pattern. It's, oh damn, it's just a matter of like, like looking for an opening and finding it. And, uh, and not noobing it up. Oh man, see that, that's, that's freaking awkward, man. Actually, do they only shoot so many bullets and then they stop? Is that the case? It's, it looked like it stopped shooting, so if I just wait, will it run out of bullets and I can just go right by? Huh, okay, cool. And also, you can shoot the little, um, things that are launching the bullets and, um, and destroy, oh, goddamn. And, uh, destroy them and they'll stop shooting, I guess. But at the same time, there's so many of them. Oh, goddamn, I was trying to shoot it, I didn't see the bullet coming right at me, damn. Okay. Yeah, by the t it's almost not worth destroying him, because it seems like by the time you pump enough bullets into it, it would have been better to just, like, go past it. Oh my gosh, oh man. I didn't- I don't think there was a lot, like, maybe I could have fit through that spot, or that little opening. It didn't- it sort of didn't look like- I mean, maybe I could have, but there was not a lot of wiggle room. Okay. Oh, damn, I was I was going for the speed power-up, man. I gotta get that speed power-up. I feel so helpless without having any speed, man. Oh, man, that was close. Almost ran into the goddamn wall. Uh. Okay. If I go like this, the dude... Oh, man, they put that dude right there to... Sh well. Uh, I was trying to get it, get it as soon as he appeared on screen, but they had a dude, like, right there ready to fucking snipe ya. Boy, I do like these environments, man. This is a really cool, um... Oh, shit. I couldn't back... I couldn't back away in time. These environments are pretty rad for, like, NES. I think I might have said that last time. I don't remember. But it can't be overstated, man. This is fucking cool, man. This game has a really cool look to it. Oh, shit. I would have been dead anyway. Without that speed power, up, man, I would have been fucking helpless as shit. Oh, man, boy. We're kind of off to a rough start on this episode. Dude, almost got hit again. Oh, come on, man. Okay, the good news is that I appear to have infinite continues. Um, so as much as people complain about, like, games being NES hard. Or, you know, Nintendo hard or whatever. Oh, man. I want those shots hitting him. I don't know. Uh, sometimes games do are nice and give you infinite continues. Which I would say I need. I'm also playing Splatterhouse 2 right now. Holy nuts. If I didn't have infinite continues on that shit, I would need to abuse save states. God damn. I'm not the superest, biggest fan of save states. I prefer to not use them, but if it's going to be a situation where, like, I have to play, like, the whole game over again, if I run out of lives or run out of continues or whatever, and the game is hard, then, yeah, I, I gotta, I mean, I don't, I don't got to, technically, but, you know, it's, it's reasonable, I would say, to not have to play the whole game 80 times and spend my, like, you know, I, 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 I've, I've said this in other games or whatever, but I don't have my entire childhood to spend, goddamn, uh, getting good at a game, so... Yeah, I couldn't decide to go up or down, I just picked a direction and it was the wrong way. I'm not sure if I would have survived if I would have gone the other way. But in the heat of the moment, I just picked a direction and it was not the right one. Uh, nobody, nobody ever told me it was the wrong way. Oh dear, okay, shoot. Ah, oh no! The hitbox is a little bit generous with those, uh, grabby hands. Oh jeez, oh no! I thought that they could only shoot in the one direction. How come, um, how come I was, like, at the bottom of the screen and it still hit me? Th there wasn't one at the, there wasn't one that was, like, aiming downwards, was it? I didn't see it. But wouldn't it be nice if, like, I need, I need a shot power-up. That's what I really need. I need something to make my shot stronger, dude. Yeah, those green dudes take so many hits, it's almost not worth it. Oh, dude. Why is there, like, a weird skeleton gecko-looking dude in here? He looks kind of out of place. <laughs> I guess he's not any more out of place in the grabby hands. Oh, man. Oh, damn it. Oh. I do kind of feel bad for the grabby hands. They're just reaching out. They're like, I just want, I just want to, I just want human contact. I just want to hold somebody's hand. It must be really shitty to just 
Oh, God damn it. To be a hand. And just be like, I just want to hold. I just want to hold someone's hand. I just want, the, like, the slightest amount of comfort. It's such a terrible, miserable experience. Living the life. Inside this, whatever the hell this is. Are we inside a creature? I know that life force takes place inside a giant alien. Is this also a giant alien, I'm guessing? Yeah, I guess that would make sense, because the first episode, or the episode, the first level was, um, we were sort of, like, outside, and then, like, we kind of, and then now we're inside. Oh, man. I don't like being on the bottom of the screen, man, but it kind of forces you. Oh, man. Oh, man. Man, why am I so bad at, like, like, right when I get to that part, man? I don't know. Okay, we'll try one more time. I might have to start cutting. Because this, I, because I can't have, you know, six episodes of me just dying on this part over and over again. God damn it! Okay, we'll, uh, we'll start, we'll start cutting. Maybe I'll start showing deaths. I don't know. I'll figure it out later. Uh, when I have time to think, but, but I, I guess talk, I mean, maybe I could do a little bit better if I'm not talking. So we're at that point, I think, where I need to, uh, possibly do that. So we'll be right back. Okay, is this the furthest I've been? It might be. I got a shot power-up, I think. I got some kind of power-up. I think I got the one that made me flashy. God damn it. I got the one that made me flashy. But I think I lost it immediately. Okay, we'll be right back. I think that's the furthest I've made it so far. Oh. Fucking goddamn. I think that's the furthest I made it. I made it uh, to a second power up. It was a barrier. It did not barrier me, though. Okay, I think this, okay, we're, uh, bleh. I'm in a fucking tizzy, man, but I'm fucking alive somehow, magically. I'm probably on my last life, so I'll probably have to start that whole goddamn thing over. Okay, is this a safe spot? It appears to be, but I can't, oh, what the frick? Really, the whole goddamn thing again to get another shot? Fuck. Oh, come the fuck on, man. Ugh. Fuck. I need a shot power up, man. Fuck. Oh, dude, what the fuck? That was like the easiest enemy, man. I just didn't have a shot, like I was I was like hitting the button, but like I said, you can only have two shots on screen at once. And I think there I just didn't have a shot available. Okay, another attempt at this guy. I don't have the the uh the barrier flashy God, are you fucking serious? I was about to say, but I do have the the spinny fucking thing. I don't know. Oh, my words are starting to not, uh, are not to not be very wordy. Okay. Anyway. All right. Let's keep trying. The, um, the good news is that as much as I've died, uh, I am still kind of having fun. Like this, this is a fun challenge. Um, I, it, I don't know. It, it's, it's, I don't know. I'm having fun. I think the trick is when a game doesn't give you enough time to be mad, then I think it's easier to, like, not get mad. 
Like, that's one of the reasons uh, I like Super Meat Boy. A lot of people are like, oh, it's a fucking hard game. I'm like, you don't have time to be mad at that game. By the time you die, you're already respawned. And with this one, there's no, like, like it doesn't send you back to the load screen, doesn't give you a game over screen. I mean, it does, but you can just hit the button and go right past it. And then you're already back. Okay, we're back once again. Dude, do not get hit by any of the shits, man. Oh my gosh, fuck. Finally, I was starting to wonder, I was like, do I have to destroy something else first? Oh shit, we're already going. Uh, do I, I was, cause I was like, well the whole screen is flashing, that has to mean that I'm hurting it, right? Holy shit, I did that legit, uh, I can't promise, um, that I'm gonna do the rest of the game legit. I might need to use save states. The only reason I didn't is cause that was, like, I was still, like, sorta having fun. My hand, my right hand is starting to cramp, actually. Uh, I wasn't using turbo either. Um, but holy shit, boy. Ugh, the boss wasn't even hard. I just had to, like, figure out the safe spot. I thought there was a safe spot on the left side, but I think this, you know, obviously the safe spot you saw, it was on the, was just right of center. Uh, but yeah, holy fucking shit, dude. I fucking did it, boy. And that was only level two, holy nuts. Okay, so, in the next one, we'll try the next level, and as always, thanks for watching. Please like this video and subscribe, and we'll see you next time. Have a great day, bye.